Hello everybody, this is Vince. So I'm here making this video at 11 in the morning uh, because I'm going to undertake a project upcoming soon, um, maybe in 10 days, 15 days, but if I'm impatient, 5 days. Um, so I'm going to be water cooling my system uh, the, in the end there. So first time water cooling, it's not going to be, it's not going to be your, uh, your closed loop water cool that you just go and buy all in one you just buy it and plug it in and there you go i'm gonna custom loop it's a custom water loop okay so we got the xs uh pc uh race storm uh this guy here is compatible with a lot of um sockets uh all your pretty much all your intel and your amd sockets will be covered there you get a, a, a 240 uh radiator uh so you can do uh two uh 120 fans on there or four i'm probably end up doing four in a push pull configuration uh, there so here's your water block and your reservoir it's uh the pump is in the reservoir also so it's it's a nice beginner um kind of system and I, and I decided to do this i love ncix and they ship freaking fast so uh yeah so yeah so you you'll you'll get your tubing and everything you need to make this thing work in this kit uh, I've, I've replaced a few things. Um, well, I can't take out what I want and yeah, I can't do that, but I've added some a better tubing uh, in the end there. Uh, and I also got um, compression fittings also as well. So for a grand total of, uh, what is it? Let's go to the cart and see what it is. Grand total plus, you know, tax and shipping, you're looking at 225 well, and insurance and stuff like that. You're looking at 255 even dead. So that's it. If, uh, if you, you know, if you're, if you're planning on doing this and you just want to keep the standard stuff, just remove $60 worth of stuff. Um, the, the compression fittings are mad expensive and I had to buy these guys here, um, to fit the tubing here in the end so that's that's what i decided to do uh in the end and i like i like this compression fit it's gonna be nice and black just like the uh the um water block for the cpu uh okay so the case um, i have to replace the case that i have which is the bit phoenix uh raider uh, which I've enjoyed. It's it's good, you know. Um, one two hundred millimeter at the top and one in the front. But uh, to fit this, it's not gonna work. Uh, in the end, so I decided to go with the the uh, Cooler Master uh, CM six ninety uh, two. Is it uh, two plus Nvidia edition? Uh, there's a few left. They're they're discontinued, but I you know if if I can't get this one, I'll just get the black version, the advance or whatever. Uh, in the end, there. And the reason why I'm getting this case here is because I can mount that radiator down at the bottom of the case by the power supply, which I think is freaking great uh, because everybody seems to be. Um, Mounting it at the top, which you know, that's cool. That's up to you. But heat rises. I want, I want that to be an exhaust only. You know what I mean? I don't want to be sucking hot air from the computer onto the radiator. That's supposed to be the fans are supposed to be cooling it, not heating it up uh, in the end. But that's you know whatever. That's my logic. Um, I'm sure people are gonna like. Um, have their own opinion which is cool i don't give i don't care that's how i think and that's the way it's it, it is for me i don't give a fuck what you do with your system but my system that's what i'm gonna do so it's gonna be mounted down at the bottom here so i'm gonna remove uh this hard i might even remove all of them but i might uh yeah just remove if there's a way to mount because i have an ssd and a uh uh, so SSD and a three, three and a half 
inch drive. So if, if there's a way for me to mount it like in here somewhere or on the back or somewhere, on the, on the case i'll do that but if not i'll you know i'll keep the top one and remove the bottom one so the radiator can fit right here and um <clears throat> and it looks like the motherboard part ends right here which is perfect because the radiator is probably going to be raised the f with the fans and everything it's going to be raised a lot probably up to here uh in the end there within in the pull uh push pull f configuration sucking air from underneath through the dust filter into the case air coming in from the 240 that's in the front into the case exhaust exhaust the way it's supposed to be right uh, so that's that's my plan um, I do like this case um, as for the coolant I don't have the link on this computer but it's gonna be the mayhem um, coolant the uh, can't remember the name now but it's a coolant that you can actually see the liquid moving instead of just being a color and you can't tell it's moving even though it is uh, but with this one you'll be able to tell it's moving you can see it moving so which is pretty cool so that's my plan it's gonna cost me a lot of money it's gonna cost me hundred and sixty five dollars yeah, probably, no, 300, yeah, 370, 75, or something like that, to do this upgrade, only because I needed to get a, get a new case. If this case had supported everything I wanted already, I would already purchase this, but it does not, so I'm going to have to um, buy additional stuff. Yeah, but anyways... Uh, I don't have to change a motherboard or anything like that, so all I have to do is just take out the stuff that's in here. I don't have to reformat or anything. Just take it out, pop it in here, make sure everything is... And I'm going to spend some, spend some time on this. Uh, I might do a video of the entire process and chop it up here and there um, and get everything done because you have to do leak tests and stuff like that. But you guys will know on what I'm doing. You will be informed but uh that's the whole uh the whole thing there that is my plan i might end up getting this game to dead island riptide i don't know um let me know if you, if you guys want to see any gameplay of this at all um if you do i will purchase it uh, in the end if i get comments or if um if you want to see me play the riptide game thumbs up the video if i get over 10 thumbs up i will purchase the game uh in the end there okay and then we'll do i, I guess there's co-op and stuff like that i don't know anybody on my steam list if or, or wherever I, I think it's steam yep steam um who is going to get this or anything like that but if any of you guys are going to get it, let me know. We can we can do the the let's play or the playthrough together, co-op and everything like that and you get to be in the video and everything like that. So uh let me know. Uh this video is pretty long probably, but um I thank you guys again and um look forward to the water cooling project. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.